In nearly 40 years as a head coach at the high school, junior college, college and professional level, one thing was constant for coach Ron A. Begman. He won. His coaching career took him from the small Utah hamlets of Morgan and Ephraim to the frozen north of Alaska and from a sterling eight-year career at Weber State to a small college revival in Massachusetts and the sprawling metropolis of London, England. A native of Vernal, Utah, Ron was a scrappy prep guard at Uinta High School, then went on to enjoy a four-year career at BYU where he played point guard for legendary head coach Stan Watts, whom A. Beglin joins in the WSU Hall of Fame. Ron began his coaching career at Morgan High School, where he was the head coach of the Trojans for 13 seasons and compiled a gaudy 232-79 record. In his final year as head coach in 1973-74, he led Morgan to a perfect 26-0 record and the state 2A title. A. Beglin coached prep golf at Morgan High and led the Trojans to seven straight region titles. Ron then moved south to Ephraim, Utah to become the head coach at Snow Junior College. In 10 seasons, he guided the Badgers to an overall record of 212 and 73, which included six 20 plus win seasons. Ron then ventured to Anchorage, Alaska, where he spent two seasons as an assistant coach for the Sea Wolves. In 1986, he was elevated to the head coaching position, where in five seasons he led UAA to an overall record of 109-45 and advanced to the Division II playoffs four times. The next season, a Beglin squad posted one of the biggest upsets in collegiate basketball, beating Michigan in the opening round of the Utah Classic in Salt Lake City. In April 1991, a. Beglin was selected as the seventh coach in Weber State men's basketball history. In his first season, he guided the Cats to their first winning season in two years and then back into the upper echelon of the Big Sky Conference. In his second season, he guided the Cats to their first 20-win season in eight years and posted victories over BYU, Southern Utah, and Utah State. In 1993-94, his third at WSU, Ron led the Wildcats to a second straight 20-win season and Weber State's first regular season title in 10 years. He was named Big Sky and District 7 Coach of the Year. In 1994-95, Weber State repeated as Big Sky Conference regular season champions, then won the conference postseason tournament, earning a berth in the NCAA tournament as a number 14 seed. Abe Eglin was again named the Big Sky Conference Coach of the Year. The Wildcats were sent to Tallahassee, Florida to face the number three seed Michigan State Spartans, coached by legendary head coach Judd Heathcote. Led by 27 points from Big Sky MVP Ruben Nemhard, the Wildcats stunned the Spartans 79-72. It was WSU's first win in the NCAA tournament since 1978. Less than 48 hours later, the Wildcats took on Allen Iverson and the Georgetown Hoyas, coached by John Thompson. The Cats battled the Hoyas to the last second, falling 53-51 in a tip-in at the buzzer. In 1998-99, his final year at Weber State, A. Beglin took a new group of players led by Harold Arsenault and Eddie Gill and captured the Big Sky regular and postseason titles, earning another trip to the NCAA tournament. This time, the Wildcats were paired against one of the most storied programs in NCAA basketball history, the University of North Carolina. In most likely the greatest game in WSU history, the Wildcats rode a 36-point outburst from Arsenault and defeated the Tar Heels 76-74. Two days later, the Wildcats lost another second-round heartbreaker, falling to Florida 81-74 in overtime. All totaled, A. Beglin's teams posted an overall record of 153-83 at Weber State, the second most wins by a coach in Weber State history and the eighth most in Big Sky history. His teams were an impressive 86-34 in conference games. He was named Big Sky Coach of the Year on three occasions. <laughs>